Hey guys, what's up? My name's The Cool Mike and welcome back with another episode of Little Hope. I'm scared, as always. Let's get this started. Okay. My heart is pounding, I'm sweating, and I'm about to pee my pants. Or sh crap myself. Who knows? Uh, we, we, uh, currently, we are at the police station. So... Um, I'm not so sure we'll find anything useful in here. It's derelict. You students are all the same. Doom, gloom, and negativity. Never mind how it looks, all we need is one phone to still be hooked up. Ugh. This place is a real dump even for this shithole town. Something up? Yeah, there's something kind of familiar about this place. You got a big time criminal past we don't know about? Serial jaywalker? These small town police stations all look the same. There's gotta be a phone in here someplace. You're deluded if you think there's anything here. Place is dead. Just like the rest of Little Hope. Okay. I guess we walk around. I don't see anything, so I guess there's nothing here. Yep. Oh my god! Jump scares! Jesus Christ! <sighs> that was that. There was literally nothing there but a freaking jump scare in the cabinet. Are you freaking... Kidding me? Oh my god, this place is massive. Holy crap, this place is massive. I hate this. I hate this so much with all intents and purposes. Some sort of locker rooms. Oh god. Reynolds. Little Hope Police Department. Not a clue.
This place is massive. Oh, that's a, this is a cell. I've lost everything. Uh huh. Nothing? Really? Okay. That door that that one is closed. I really don't want to open that door. Someone's knocking. That door is bad news. What are you doing? Should we really open that door by myself? Screw it. Lock. Okay, so that's lock. Hold which go. Built sixteen eighty four, demolished seventeen eighty three. It was demolished in sixteen eighty two during the little of witch trials. Many of the accused were imprisoned here. Oh great! Oh great! We're in the freaking prison where there are witches. Lovely. How big is this place? Lovely. Keep looking. Township of Little Hope, Certificate of Commendation presented to Little Hope Police Department on January 16, 1972. Officers George Reynolds and Ernie Hoffman responded to the call of concerning a house fire. That's from the intro. Arriving before the fire service, the officers with no concern for their own safety rushed into the hospital to rescue the family members trapped inside. Tragically, many lives were lost and they were beaten back by the flames. However, the mayor chief of the police and a grateful public thanked the police department. For their continued dedication service, April 4th, to Samuel A. Cover, Mayor.
This was her way out. It's freaking too quiet, I hate it. got to be something TC and that's the moon hippie artifacts so the moon is TC. Okay. There was the sun and the moon part that we need. Okay, I'm... That's a terrifying angle. Before we do that... That's a terrifying angle for a phone. Let's explore a bit farther. Why is it just focusing on that? Is there anything else here? Aside from the phone? <sighs> Jesus Christ. We have a winner found a phone this could be our way out it's dead Mine's dead <coughs> shit <laughs> whoa hey take it easy can you stop reacting to every setback like a child Look here. The cable is missing. Uh, there's got to be a cable here someplace. So 
Search for a phone cable. I'm so scared, guys. The reason why I'm not talking is because... What is that? Oh, that creepy ass. It's ringing. Oh. A phone without a cord what ringing. Think? Answer it. Sir, did cautious. Let's think about this. Wait. Let's think about this. Yeah, let's think about that. It's a phone that has to the goddamn phone. Hey, come on. Be a man for once in your miserable life. Fine. Hello? Who is this? Who's on the line? I can't tell, but they sound in pretty bad shape. This is getting way too crazy. Just hang up. Do not hang up. This is our best shot at finding out what's going on here. Damnation awaits if you do. We have an understanding, do we not? No evil word shall leave my lips. Should you breathe a word, or the edge of a word about the other things, then I will come to you in the black of some terrible night and bring a reckoning that will shudder you. Now, Reverend, let us begin. Enough time has gone begging. Go be with you, kin. I beseech this court. And, good Judge Wyman, do not be fooled by the protestations of the accused. The devil is the master of deceit. All his servants feign innocence. They can do little else. I solemnly swear before God, I am innocent of all accusations against Hush me. Hush now, Amy. What the hell should we do? I mean no offence, Reverend Carver. I do not believe any of my neighbours. Those who know me best will speak out against me. They know who I am. That I side with the righteous. I will not be caught in the web of your deception. The devil hides himself where he is least expected. My wife is no devil's plaything, Reverend. I beg the court's forgiveness. But I stand by my statement. My wife Amy is innocent. I respectfully ask this good court to pay no mind to the words of a man whose very home is foul with the stench of brimstone. I feel a chill in my bones. What manner of evil is this? The beast has his malevolent gaze upon us. His servant is among us. Stay out of this. The supposed evidence against me is little more than spiteful imaginings. If there be darkness here among us, I will shine... Go no! Mary? Mary, my sister, what ails you? What have you done to this child? You have bound an innocent girl into a pact with the devil himself. The poor creature seems possessed. No doubt you're doing. It's not true, Reverend. Why have you taken against me so? We will the see the truth of it. 
Amy, lay your hands on Mary. Let us see what occurs. If I am correct, your touch will release her from this affliction. It must be so, if you are the one who bewitched her. You can take much more. Leave her alone. Leave her alone! Who speaks? Who's there? God preserve us. Please. The master can I help you now. It is too late. They are here among us. They are here among us. No! What more proof is needed that the devil walks among us in little hope? <laughs> Take heed and pray. The devil is here in this very room. Yeah, they... Protect yourselves. Seek out the Lord. What the hell was that shit? Was that for real? Didn't the witch trials happen centuries ago? Most of them over 300 years ago. Then how come we just saw one? Like I say, I have no good explanation. That little girl who had some kind of seizure. What do you think was going on there? I know that little girl. She's the one me and Angela saw back in the woods. That woman, my double? What's she looking at if the trial goes against her? The sentence for confirmed witches in Little Hope was always brutal. Violent death, drowning, hanging, burning. Well, let's hope she is, or was, found innocent. Accusations were often malicious, made by someone with a grudge or by meddling liars, like that little girl, who took perverse pleasure in poisoning their own communities. Indignant. I'm, I'm not gonna say anything, because we're not sure. woman my double was very distressed almost traumatized yeah it was tough to watch for sure she she looked like Angela puzzled her husband I noticed something else weird yeah her husband he looked a lot like you professor The two people with that little brat look just like Daniel and Taylor. What the hell does all this mean? Who's that? Hey, Professor! You in there? Come on, let's go. Hey, Taylor! We're in here! We can't open the damn doors! <sighs> We can't either! They must be locked! Let's all try to force the handle! In three, two, one... <laughs> Taylor. Hey, Professor. Find anything that could get us out of here? Nah, big fat nothing back there. Just a pile of junk. Still think splitting up was a smart move? I would say I'm now... More open to exploring other options. I'm glad you two are finding this funny. Personally, I think we're in deep shit here. You know what happened to your double, right? She was accused of witchcraft. Not just accused. Tried, found guilty, and condemned. We need to know what that woman is facing. What's gonna happen to her next? I like the idea. But how would we even begin to find that out? You've already been down those paths. Maybe the answer lies 
down the one path we haven't taken yet. Where's that? What the hell? This is fucking crazy. We have no clue what we're getting ourselves into. Poor Troy. It's already been a hell of a night, but I'm sure we'll pull through. The geeky exterior is all play. There's a warrior in there. Oh god. Why is it so foggy? I hate it. Alright, so how long? Hello? Okay, it's... Uh, uh, my, my ball... Okay, should I keep playing? I'm scared. Uh, screw it. Here we go again with the jump scares. Oh god. The fog, my god, the fog. I don't even see where I'm going. Jesus Christ, I don't even know where I'm going. I'm just running in circles because I don't know where I'm going. Okay. Okay, another one. Is that the driver? Premonition unlock. Oh, current objective leads to the towards the town stick together. Angela. Andrew Taylor Dismissive Curious Someone getting arrested. I think that's the driver. Yeah, and it says that's the symbol of the police department. I demanded that the present let go of Mary. Homegrown hero. Lost. Andrew thought that the girl he and Angela met meant no harm. Oh, that's not good. 
Andrew agreed with John that Mary had some blame for the trial they witnessed. Andrew agreed with the John that Mary held some blame for that trial they witnessed. Andrew Mary uh, loss let it blame at Amy appeared to have seizured during Amy's trial that's not a seizure that she's pretending because the priests probably told her to do that you found a gun in old shack Sean found the police the initial TC. I wonder if it's still or something also appears on the moon charm. Yep, TC. A box labeled hippie jock inside is a large crescent moon marked with the initials TC. This book, Modern ma uh, Magic is Ritual, identifies this moon symbol as being a symbol of feminine magic. That book is also initial TC. Soon for the police officers who were first on the scene at the Clark House. Uh, from 1972, Anthony Clark survived the fire and was later cleared of any wrongdoings. Oh boy, Andrew and John. John reassured under that there was nothing wrong with him. Andrew. Andrew moved towards Joseph, which upset John. Toward Joseph? Andrew moved towards Joseph with upset John. Drew was pessimistic over finding a phone in the police station. Pessimistic over finding a phone at the police station. Oh, okay. John was impressed with Andrew's ability to throw a rock. John was not happy to find out that Andrew has a gun. Andrew didn't listen to John's advice about jumping to conclusions. Advice about jumping to conclusions. Oh boy, I am. Angela sided with Andrew, deciding she will head into town with John. Angela chose to follow John in the fog. Okay. Taylor apologized to the group for, for letting out at them. Taylor cut off John before they could talk about town a little. Of a little while. Taylor argument to John and they decided to head to town. Taylor agreed to John and tried calling for the help again. Taylor got irritated with John when asked to help after the bus crash. Okay, at least we found one. So I'm guessing the bus driver is involved with this.
Okay, why can you not go there then? Billy Johnson, 1836-1858 TJ Right? A promising young author who died tragically after writing her first novel TJ T no this is TC It's not TJ it's TC No So that's not the person on the moon I hate this camera angles. Rock and roll. The spirit of Father of Fire, Jewel Curse, The Roadhouse, 33 to 50. It will Saturday, February 12. What's, what's with the Okay, why? Oh yeah, I've lost everything. My stretch in the walls, I lost everything. Poster from Rahul Govardhan and Gitaris who resembles Daniel. Oh yeah, because the first uh huh. Daniel. You need to see this. What is it? You've been keeping your career as a guitar player under wraps. What the How is that even possible? Oh, we're going back to the bridge again. Yippee. That's a bridge. The fog was the reason for the diversion. We were never meant to make it out of here. Oh, God. Someone's gonna die. I can't see for shit. Oh God. Jesus. Yep. That's a bad place. Black. I don't want to go anywhere near it. That's a broken bridge. Okay. Who's first up? Hmm. Huh. Professor? You keep telling us you're in charge, so... Okay. Sure thing. Is it safe to cross? Don't stress. The professor and me will make sure you get across, no problem. We'll get... I'm not gonna say anything. Oh boy.
Fog. My God, what do we do? We can't stay here. Of our Lord 1692, we are here present to bear witness to a just execution. No! Amy is declared guilty of consorting with the devil and is to be drowned as a witch and sorceress. Let us pray in silence for her soul. I've done no wrong. I am no witch. I do not deserve death. I beg you. I don't know how to help you. Tell me what I can do. Please, sir. You must help me. You must. The devil is in the wind, seeking to help his own. He would release her from the chains. Isaac, oh. we must conclude our business here swiftly. The will of the court must be imposed before it's too late. The devil fortifies her. You must bind her tightly. Oh, if he, he doesn't, the priest doesn't see us. Now I understand. You cannot do this. Isaac, I am innocent. fulfill the will of the court. Send this witch back into the lap of her master, lest he come for Hold us it. all. Little Hope is already lost, shrouded in evil. But not as you claim from witchcraft or outside demons, we are poison from within. You will not save yourself with riddles. There is no riddle. The devil takes many forms. You know that better than any. If Lil Hopi has hid himself under a shroud of innocence, taken the form of a child by a fuser. While Mary still draws breath, Lil Hope remains beyond salvation. There lies your evil reverence. Be your very fix. Isaac. And she drowned. Your double was pushed into the river in chains. She drowned. Oh, frick, I should have said that. Yeah, I shouldn't have said that. I should have said nothing. All right, I'll go first. <clears throat> okay, you two, get on down here. Oh god, what now? Oh, there's something in the water, isn't it? What the hell is that? Oh! Get away from it! Run! Get the hell out of there! Look out! Shit! Give me a hand here! 
Hold on, hold on. No, no. I'm coming back for you, John. Hold on. Reach up and grab my hand. Jump up and grab onto me. Okay, I trust you. What the hell is that thing? For the love of all that is on. Is that the wind? Oh my god, is that the thing? The the one that that was accused of witchcraft? Oh my heart. I wasn't talking. Phew, that was really quite close for Angela. She was almost lost to a fate worse than death. Not that there's anything particularly wrong with death. Well done. Not a soul lost so far. Things could have been quite different. As the stakes seem to have been elevated, that gun might prove to be a lifesaver. Don't you think? Or the precise opposite? boys have some interesting theories. Maybe you're choosing to believe Daniel's theory, that they're already dead. My dream was lengthened after life. Oh, then began the tempest to my soul. I passed, methought, the melancholy flood. Okay. Sour ferryman. Which poets write of unto the kingdom of perpetual night. It's possible, I suppose. Maybe the bus driver can shed some light. This must be very confusing for you right now. Doppelgangers, witches, Ghosts, death, and demons? What could possibly tie all of these souls together? I dare say we'll find out. Hmm? I have been granted permission to give you a single hint. Tempted? Okay then, we will once again turn to the Bard for some cryptic inspiration. I met him once, you know. I meet everybody once. Act 5, Scene 1, where Cleomenes begs Leontes to forgive himself for causing the death of Hermione. Do as the heavens have done. Forget your evil. With them, forgive yourself. Go on then. As terrifying as it might be, you should get back to it. Okay. All right, so I'm gonna end it there because that was too much for me to handle. I uh, hope you guys enjoy. Um, if you guys enjoy it, be sure to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe now if you haven't. And uh, as always, uh, sus subscribe now for more content. And as always, I will see you guys next time with another brand new video. This is the Cool Mike signing off. Goodbye.